That lady divorcing her husband and she got seven kids. So I woke up extra early so I could do gorgeous hair. I washed it last night and blow dried it. That way I could style it this morning. I was looking on Instagram and this lady was doing like some zigzag curve parts. <laughs> so I tried to do it. Now, if you know me, you know I cannot do hair. And what made it even more challenging was the fact that I had... All seven of my kids awake. I thought that they would still be asleep, but everybody woke up. So I have children putting on clothes, children crying for me, children that don't want to get from by me. That's gorgeous. So I'm uh, braiding her hair to the best of my abilities. I finally picked Phenomenal up and just put him in my shirt because he is acting up. I'm bouncing him, talking to him like, okay, it's okay, KK Ja, KK Ja, Papi. He finally goes to sleep. I go ahead and put gorgeous hair stuff up. I keep it under her nightstand and pick up her book bag, grab her some socks so she could put on her shoes. Once we did this, it was off to the restroom. I have children that may wet the bed. So Amazing Life had wet the bed. At this point, phenomenal asleep. This is how gorgeous hair turned out. Now we have to give Amazing Life a bath because I don't want my son going to daycare smelling like piss. So I give him a bath and I'm wetting his hair because I got to comb it and stuff. Phenomenal is still asleep. He always just want to be on me. All my kids are. Caution. If you wear your babies, they're going to be attached. All right. Got Amazing Life dressed. Now it's on to Wonderful. Got him dressed. Checked on Gregory McKay. He was dressed and Wonderful was in there talking and playing with him. After that, it was time to get Gregory McKay to school. I already dropped off Gorgeous and McIntyre. Once we did that, it was time to drop Amazing Life off for his first day of VPK. Wonderful will start next Monday at this same daycare. Choices dressing Mr. Teddy. And I just feel like, oh my God, this is a lot to do with no help. But I got through it, so I'm proud of myself.